this is weird. Hi, uh, welcome to my channel and shit. Um, I haven't done this in a long time. And it feels weird. Like, it definitely does. It doesn't feel natural to be able to just sit down. Um, I think I'm currently sat far too close to the camera. So look, hold on. Uh, too close. Um, but I always find that this is much better. Um, I hope you've all been good and stuff. Um, I've been really busy. I've moved into uni. Um, currently my second term. Um, you might have seen one of the projects I uploaded um, last um, during during December. I uploaded like a little project I've been working on, which is good. And I'm currently working on um, a film that I'm making. I'm not entirely happy with it. Um, and I don't think I will be happy with it, even once it's been finished. Um, but it's the sort of thing I can make and then look at it and be like, yeah, okay, that's where, I would, that's where I need to improve. And then use that as like a foundation to then go and remake it in like a few years' time. Um, which is nice. Um, what, else have I, what else have I been up to? Um, I bought um, a camera. Um, I bought a, an analog camera. Which is really nice. Um, I'll go get it. Hold on. Um, so I bought this. It's um, an Olympus OM30. I got it off eBay for like fifty pounds, um, which isn't bad. Um, and a roll of film costs about six pounds, um, and it's about the same sort of price to get it processed. Um, so that's that's pretty fun. Um, yeah, I don't really know where I want to go YouTube-wise. I know that when I uploaded my Fine Bros video the other day, that I kind of wanted to get back into the swing of it. Um, because I really enjoyed, I remember really enjoyed doing this for a long time. Um, but then I just got like really dragged down by the whole thing. Like YouTube seemed more of a chore than it did as a, like a platform. Um, which I think every creator suffers with at some point. Um, even though I wouldn't ever dare call myself a creator because I don't think I would class what I did as create. Like, I don't know, like all of my videos that I've got on my channel. Uh, the ones that are privated included um, like there's only a few that are good like there are only a few that I'd say yeah that's that's like a video that I'm happy of um, which is which is a shame and I think that I want to kind of make a bit more than I have been doing um, but I've also been like reading um, <laughs> just generally reading um, I've been reading a bit more and going to the cinema a bit more. Like I went to go see Room the other day, which is one of the Oscar, uh, one of the new Oscar films, uh, which is really good. Um, like it's better than really good. It's fucking awesome, but not awesome in like the wow, this is incredible, like Mad Max sort of way, but in the shit, this is just a heavy fucking film. Um, but it works. It totally works. Um, and then what else have I seen? I've seen Creed, the new Rocky Balboa film, um, which. I wasn't won over by, but Sylvester Stallone's performance was really good. And I'm off to see The Revenant sometime this week. Uh, I'm not sure if that if my microphone's picking that up, but that's my housemate. Yeah. Um, and I went to um, the BFI film thing. Um, the other day, which was pretty good, I saw a, a Jean-Luc Gollard film from the 1960s called Band of uh, which was then followed by a Q&A with Anna Karenina. Um, not the Kira Knightley film, uh, the actress, <laughs> um, which was really interesting, but the questions were more focused on, oh, what was it like with so-and-so? What was it like doing this? What was it like doing that? Whereas, I guess from a film person, from a film, like, lover's perspective I was really hoping that there'd be more on like the auteur theory and Jean-Luc Goddard and Cahir de Cinema and stuff like that but I also know that like the, the Cahir de Cinema and as I say auteur theory has been like documented a shit ton so I don't know like what she would add to it although she was like married to the guy so could have a bit more Stuff to that. Um, what else have I, what else has happened? I went to go see. Is that Wicked? Yeah, went to see Wicked the other day. Um, that was good. I was going to say it was Wicked, but I think that joke's overused. 
Um, I've like been up for the last <sighs> nearly 12 hours. I've slept for three of them. Um, so I'm pretty tired. Um, pretty tired of making a YouTube video, which is why my voice and like total thing is just <laughs> like usually I do these standing up, but I have a chair and I have a window that's doing semi-decent lighting. Um, so I thought I'd just say another chat. Well, it's not chat, it's more of me telling you what's been going on. Um, and I'm off to London soon. I'm going to this Disney event, uh, which is a screening of Tangled. Um, followed by a Q&A with one of the directors, one of the animators at Disney, which should be good, um, which I'm looking forward to. Follow and then in a couple of weeks time, I'm going to um, a talk with Mark Kermode, um, who's a British film critic. Um, yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. Um, I want to do a video, I want to do a couple of videos um, coming up. I want to do a video on well, it depends. I'm thinking of doing a video on my discussion of the, the, the video that I uploaded the other day about the fine bros and stuff like that, uh, because that's a discussion that needs to be had. But I'm kind of like thinking maybe I won't just because it seems like it's like the hate is getting too much. And it just seems like if I would add to it, it just wouldn't wouldn't do much for the discussion. Um, but I'll see how I feel. But I also want to do a video in two or three weeks time all about the Oscars because um, this month is the film month so you've got in like two weeks time the BAFTAs which is the British Academy Film Television Awards um, but, but that's what it's called but it's basically just the film awards for British films and then the following week you've got, then got the Oscars um, and I've already got my Oscar predictions done um, even though like they'll probably change um, as I see more Oscar films in the leading weeks um, also I have short hair now and I actually look like an adult rather than a scrawny teenager with braces going oh hello don't forget to like and subscribe and I'm hashtag relatable whereas now I'm just a cynical old cynical man who's like no don't bother um, I would be more energetic but I'm so tired. You have no idea. I was up this morning at five because I have work. Um, but yeah, it was quite therapeutic to just sit down and have a chat. Um, yeah. I have no idea when I'll upload again. Um, but I also think that, uh, like, last time I was doing YouTubing properly, it was more of a political thing. Like, I was like, oh, I won't upload because that video didn't do so well. And, oh, this isn't doing so good oh I won't do this um but I really should just get past that and do what I want to do um so any films that I make and shit will go up on here and I also want to do more film reviews so I'll probably film film reviews straight after this video because Star Wars obviously um and then saying that I probably won't because I'm tired <laughs> um I bought a PS4 as well that's my PS4 next to me um yeah Hope, I'll, I'm not going to say that there'll be more videos and that they'll be like better but I'd like to think that I'd be creating more more well yeah more frequently because I just I don't know I think I think that it needs there needs to be a point where I, I stop like being afraid well not afraid but like uh, reluctant I suppose for a better word to I shouldn't be so reluctant to create videos that I want to make and so anxious for any all any and all like reactions that they'll get I suppose um also excuse the state of my room it is a shithole currently and I, I cannot for the life of me be asked to clean it um although I need to um but yeah I will see you guys in my next video, whenever that may be. Um, Alright.